Look at the lip. Look at the lily lip. Welcome back to my channel and it's I know it's been a really long time but we don't we don't need to talk about that how are you are you good I kind of missed you um I haven't been doing YouTube because I've been making well I made a couple videos was totally not proud of them at all um thought they were horrible didn't even want to put them out on the internet so they're not up um, and then I've just been really busy and YouTube kind of had to take a back seat, which kind of sucks, but it just kind of needed to happen, you know. I just have been working and looking for jobs and that's like the hardest thing you could possibly do. So it's just, it's been a lot and I just haven't had time, but yesterday I was out shopping with my friend because we were getting some stuff for work. And we came across these cool lip kits. And they were only $6, so I'm like, let's see if they work. These are from Tattoo Junkie. They look like this. You can get them at Target, and they're $6. Just, like, look at the pictures on them. Like, I have such high expectations for these. Um, but I thought I'd try them out with you together to see if they actually work because if these actually work it's six dollars this could be like you could make your own freaking metallic lip for six dollars or it kind of could be like i feel like it's kind of like could be like a kylie lip kit crossed with a path 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 hmm. pat mcgrath lust 004 kit um obviously that has more but it was like 75 dollars i didn't even get to that it's, it's probably worth it, but mm -mm. So, we're gonna go ahead and try these. And I think I'm gonna try Cheeky first. Yeah. By the way, if like my voice sounds like this, um, I'm, I'm not sick yet. Uh, I just uh, play a zombie at a haunted house and I lost my voice after two nights. I'm never gonna get this open. Okay. Oh, okay, I'm getting it. Oh. I didn't do anything. Okay, so this is the first one. And look at the cute little packaging on it. It's so cute. And there's like the little glitter. It's so cute. Okay. So this is the lip paint. So it says it's smudge proof. So we're going to test that out. But I got to grab my lip brush because I don't use applicators on these anymore. Because I'm a make artist. It looks like a cute color. I'm pretty, pretty excited. Okay, we're just gonna snip a little off of there. I had a mirror. It smells. It smells kind of like vanilla. Okay, let's put this up. Oh, okay. Hello? Do you see the freaking pigment on these things? It's a tiny bit patchy, but that's just because my lips are, like, super dry. It smells like vanilla, and that pigment, though... Hello? Hi. Mmm. Oh, okay. So... Looking at it, it's actually just a really pretty color on its own. Like, I really like it. Like, am I... I'm not washed out, right? Okay. I don't know if I'm washed out. I look washed out on the viewfinder, but I might not be. But I oh my god, and it's almost dry too. Okay, just for the lip, just for the little this alone, that's actually really good for six dollars. It's a little streaky, little patchy. It just, I guess it would depend on what brush you use. But that's incredible. And it's already, like, dry. Um, and it's not really sticky at all. It's really pretty color. And they come in a bunch of colors. There was, like, a blue. There was, like, 
there was other colors and just like look at that I, I mean that's insane for six dollars I am very impressed oh that's my cat I was wondering what the hell was going on so that's what that looks like it looks really really pretty I'm actually gonna apply it with a brush because I don't trust myself so this brush has brown on it. I have been so tired. I have not washed any of my brushes. A bit and let's see. Oh, okay. Hello. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. It feels like you're putting eyeshadow on your lips, but that's okay. Um, I'm so impressed right now. Like, that looks amazing. Uh, hello, metallic lips. Made it all by myself. That's actually, like, really freaking pretty. Like, that's pretty. Like, I would wear this. Like, I would even wear it with the lip effect on it. That is so pretty. Like, I'm looking at the mirror behind this. Damn! This is really, really pretty. Like, I'm really, like, 100% impressed with this. This was $6. $6. Okay. This, I mean, it literally, like, my lips are not the best example to have this on. But, like, comparing it to this, it's pretty freaking close. Oh, that's actually really pretty. You just need like barely any and you put it on your lips. It's not uncomfortable to me. Uh, it does feel a little bit dry, but I think that kind of happens with like most like liquid lips like and then you put like powder over it. Obviously, it's going to do something, but I just like I'm in love and I just I I need a picture. I need a picture. Stay with me while I take a picture because these are just so pretty. Definitely like cheeky. I like I like the color because it's like a light nude, but it's not too light. And I really like the effect. I think that's really cool. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and take this off, and then we're gonna put on this one and see if this one is as good. So stay with me. Real fast, I forgot to say, I did kind of do like a smudge test and like some of the shimmer does come off, but like it's pretty like pretty much still there. Like it's it's definitely not coming off of my lips pretty easily. So I definitely think that it's smudge proof. Hey guys, it's Future Liv. I just wanted to let you know that um, I started eating and drinking water and I was left with like a chola mustache. So it does come off very easily when eating and drinking, so I wouldn't recommend it for that. But other than that, it stays all day. Yeah. I am, I just, I'm impressed, so. Okay. Hey guys, so I am back, and basically I just went and took it off with, you know, some makeup remover, and then I just took my wonderful bubblegum scrub blush just to kind of rejuvenate my lips after um, putting that on um, now we're gonna try in this next one I think this one is yeah this one's called whatever and just looking at this like this is come on dudes this one also smells like vanilla cupcakes I don't know, I did my best. So, I actually really like this. Um, I really like always, I really like dark colors. Um, and I feel like a bomb ass vampire right now. Like, um, that's not a proper vampire. But, um, I really do like this color. Again, it's like a tiny bit streaky, but it's like you can honestly fix it, and it's probably because I'm using a, a brush like with actual like like hairs that it's just like 
being weird. But I mean, look at that. Hello. I think it looks like really, really nice. I think, yeah, it is a little streaky and a little patchy in places, but that's again, probably from the brush. But I think like it's already dry. Um, it's not, but it's not coming off on my fingers at all. That's crazy. I, that, that just like blows my mind. So I think everyone needs to go out and buy these. Okay, you need to go out and buy these. <coughs> Even if you like pay six dollars, it's worth it just for this. Just for this. It's a six dollar liquid lip that is actually good. Come on, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. You can't beat it. There's no one who has, well, ColourPop my head's a five dollar one, but mm, 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 I like these better. So now we're gonna do the lip effect. It's actually uh, this really cool thing. I think it's gonna look like the picture um, the picture again is like high def picture, so it's kind of like you set me up to fail. But I feel like the color of my lips and the color of this lip is pretty, pretty close. And again, you probably could do like one and a half layers of this color if you really wanted to wear it on its own. But if you're not, like, who really cares because you're putting a lip effect over it? I'm sorry, I'm just having trouble getting this little sucker out. Out, uh, I don't trust myself, so it's like gonna explode everywhere. So let's not let's not do it. It's really freaking pretty. It's really freaking pretty. Like look at. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Sometimes I like being like a really stupid white girl. Cause I am one. Okay, let's do this. Yes, that's how downturned my lip are. I can't see where the product is going if I don't do this. I, I, you know, I've come to embrace my lips. But it's hard having downturned lips, okay? It's just hard. It's hard. So that's this one. And I really like it. I really like it. I think that... Ah! Stop! Falling. Okay. Um. I feel like uh my lip is not exactly like this. I feel like maybe if I packed on the glitter a little bit more, but I didn't want to pack it on because that's having that that's like a lot of effect on your like. That's like a lot to put on your lips, but I like the sheen of it. I think it's really pretty. You know, it's definitely not the red that it shows up as, but I think that's okay. I think it still gives a good effect. I think you could probably build up this red to it if you really wanted to. I just didn't want to, because um, basically plan a trip to Target and go to the Halloween section and pick up some of this, or you could probably go to TattooJunkie.com right there. You can go to TattooJunkie.com and they'll probably have these too. These are wonderful. Like, I just want to get all of them just for the liquid lipsticks. And then to have, like, all these little pigments. Like, you could probably use these on your eyes, honestly. Because just because they say lip effects doesn't mean they're actually just used for your lips, okay? Um, I learned that lesson very, very young. But, um, yeah. Go out and get these. These are wonderful. Your local Target probably sells them in their Halloween section. And it's really friggin' awesome. It's really, really Really friggin' awesome. Thank you for watching this video. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you like anything that I put up here. And I do try, I am gonna try and post more. I'm actually gonna do probably, you're gonna laugh at me. I'm gonna do Halloween videos after Halloween um, because Halloween is really busy and I don't have time for that. Um, but, 
Uh, I definitely, definitely will be putting up some pretty cool Halloween stuff after Halloween because the friends that I have and the people that I have, um, excuse me, Halloween is 365 days a year. It does not end at October 31st, okay? It does, no, it doesn't. By the way, do you like my cute little sign for Halloween? It's my only Halloween decoration because I don't really celebrate holidays because my family's weird. Um, <laughs> we just haven't had a, a holiday in a while. So I got this cute little sign of decorating my little vanity with. I think it's so cute. I love it. Anyway, um, I'm going to stop being weird now. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like a look at this. Oh, so pretty. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video if you liked these look at lips. And comment down below, what are your plans for Halloween? What are you doing? What you doing, girl? And I can tell you my plans for Halloween. I'll be working at um, my haunted house. It's called Reaper's Realm, um, where I live. I'll be working there, and I'll be working actually down the street doing Halloween makeup for a bunch of people all over the weekend at a drive-in just down the street. And... Um, I'm so super excited about that. I have like this bin right here. I don't know if you can see it. It's just filled with SFX stuff. So I'm super, super excited for that. So I'm going to have like the best Halloween I've ever had. And I'm so excited. So I hope you guys had the best Halloween. And if I don't post before Halloween, then I will see you guys afterwards when it comes time for Thanksgiving and Christmas. I think. I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace and love. Bye.